Welcome to Small Talk Daily for Tuesday, July 20th, 2010. This morning I wanted to cover something that's used in Small Talk extensively, and that's polymorphism. In this case, the kind of polymorphism that I use in Bottom Feeder is a good example of things that people do quite a lot. So I have this object called an RSS feed, and I have a method here called isFeed. And that's a check question that is asked. If I go to senders of isFeed, you can see some of the ways I use it. So I have down here, so I have is, you know, setting isFeed, and then down here I have this is a feeder folder is feed if true do this otherwise don't do that so you can see the way it's used I check to see if something's a feed if it's not a feed don't do whatever that is if it is a feed sometimes I do things that are appropriate to feeds so it's a check question now you have to ask well you've implemented it for is feed what about all the other things in the system how do you handle that well that's where small talk flexibility comes in handy I'm going to go to implementers and over here you'll find that I've got an implementation in object is feed is false and in other places in the system, I say, well, here, this is false. Here, it's true. A feed list, it's false. So I have various things that I say, yes, this is a feed. Various other things, it's not a feed. So I come down here, that thing is a feed. So I ask the question at object, and it always says, nope, not a feed. And then various other objects say, yes, I am. And then in subclasses of things that say they are a feed, sometimes I turn around and say, no, you're not really a feed. So that means I can do this kind of check all over the system. And this is polymorphism in action. And it's the way it's done in Smalltalk quite a lot. Now, it's come up before the question that, well, this doesn't work and play well with other implementations. What if two or three people write code that tries to merge together into one application, and everybody's implemented their own version of is mumble? Well, for one thing, that's not that common. And for another thing, that's what testing is for. But in general, in Smalltalk, we have a lot of power, and you have to use it responsibly. So that's about it for today. Until next time, have fun with Smalltalk.